everyone, and I'm here yet again with Jill, the founder and creator of Fixie Makeup. Hi there. Hi. Thanks again for joining me. Oh, no worries. It's um, fun. I know. We're having so much fun making makeup together. As you guys may have remembered, we have made a custom blush and a beautiful custom eyeshadow that I cannot wait to be wearing in Palm Springs soon. Well, today we are going to do something super fun. I think it's super fun. I we're, agree. We're going to do a high-low mix for pressed face powder. So like a pressed pigmented face powder. So I've got the lowest of the low, yet will do you in a pinch, wet and wild, and I wear it, this is sad, almost daily. Oh, so you love this one. I, I, you know what I do, because I throw it in my bag for work, and I work at a school. Okay. And I teach six hours of yoga every day, and so I'm moving constantly. So not only do I get oily, but there's some sweat involved too. Right. Depending on how vigorous we're working out or if it's kindergartners. Because, wow. <laughs> Kindergarten <laughs> first and second. That is motion. Um, so, yeah, this is great to help mattify the shine. I actually don't carry blotting papers around. And I just recently discovered setting spray. Uh, okay. I'm not a makeup I girl. Know, but I the older I get in that. life, the more I'm getting into makeup, like I have said before. So we're going to mix these two colors today. We're going to see what happens. Now, I I'm am... I'm concerned on this one. I'm so taking a big I'm chance. I'm not going to lie. I hope you're not going to... Yeah, I'm taking a big chance here because the Kat Von D Locket uh, pigmented powder is a loose powder. So theoretically, this should not work. Yeah, we don't know. We're I'm not sure if this happen. is going to press well. We'll find out. Yeah. I haven't had a ton of luck with a lot of the loose powders. So we're just So we'll see. see. Although... It... Maybe because we're adding in some of the pressed, yeah. we'll be fine. That's that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. You know, if you want and not, I you know, put not to scare you, yeah, <laughs> not to scare you, but we could do less as a test we could rather than a big pan. You could go like the kit comes with three different sizes. Here's my so thought. here you go. That is a great idea. But, but here's my thought: go hard or go home. All right, go with a pointy edge, please. I can't watch that otherwise. Because so I simple. know how this is going to work. So, so that's the problem when you do makeup for me. It's, you're going to get commentary. I love it. I'm just I love it. So now I'm going to go back in with the scrapey edge. There you go. Oh, yeah. She's got so all it's, the bits. It's like all of a sudden I figured out how to do this. All the bits. Because I've been doing this. No, she I gets it. it now. I get it. I love it. So I'm wearing some glasses that obviously need to be tightened up. Sorry about that, Brian. Brian's my, Brian? Brian's my glasses guy. Oh. At that's where? Funny. Uh, Eyes of the World in Denver. Oh, is that the Cherry Creek one? Uh, he's in the city park. Actually, really oh, pretty close to where you live. He's on the Gaylord and 17th-ish. Oh, so, not fun. far. Great, great stuff. Yeah, hi, Denver. Okay, so... Right, so how are you going to do this? Now, how here's much? the other thing. So, I've got quite a bit of this. Now, I don't want to overly pigment for a couple of reasons. And you can give me your professional opinion as well. I don't want to overly pigment because I don't want creases. My fine lines begin to show the more pigmentation of powder I have. Okay. So that's why this only gets used kind of if I'm going out for a little while at night or, you know, like a date night and then we're not going to be out Does all this day. get crusty on you? Like, uh, this like crease it's on creasing me. on you. Like, this can get creasy Well, and that's where your setting spray is going to really help. And like good moisture before you oh, girl. put oh, it on, yeah. you know? So I'm going to go with what is approximately... I mean, I, less, we're going with less than a teaspoon for sure. You think? I would put all that in that you're about to do. Okay. So You don't think so? No, I, mean, I think you're right. So we're going Because I don't think you're going to actually get too much, much pigmentation. of pigment. Because loose powders are, in theory, you have to build up. Right? Well, and that's probably very true with this particular powder. Because I'm um, looking at that color and I'm guessing that's a build. And it's also um, very, very light because I it's... Well, it's called it's, translucent, but it's not, as you can see. No, well, I don't see it on. Yeah, it's pigmented. For it sure. really is. Yeah. Okay. Definitely. It's so for right me, now, it would actually. probably be a translucent. Yeah, it's on right now. Okay. And you can see it right. Yeah, now. I can, can see you it. You can see it in the pores and stuff. No, I can't. Your right. pores are gorgeous. It's just so nice. So I'm gonna add more. Are you gonna do a little more? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do a little more. I think that's probably plenty where you're at. I right, really great. do. Great. I would leave it at that. And that's what we're gonna do because, like I said, I don't know how that's gonna. Prove. 
this. I can't wait to see. And, I'm, and here's why I'm not super worried about how it's going to press is because if I have to dump this back into another container and, and use it, it as a powder, I'm fine. Which you can. Yeah. But you know what I want to try with this? Tell. Is let's press Do it without tell. the spray first. Okay. Let's give it the almighty um, press and like see what happens. Because mineral makeup's don't necessarily need the binder. Cool. And my guess is Kat Von D has some mineral in it. Do we think so? Here you, Let's, you can let check out some stuff. I don't know if it's on there. I know that her stuff is all vegan, which is awesome, including her brushes. Um, she, she's actually I'm one of. Reach in front of you. Here, so I'm kind of on. a nerd. There's only a couple of like high end makeups that I will invest in. And <laughs> this makes me sound so old, but I really love their stuff. It Cosmetics. And it? Amazing Yeah, stuff. I like it. Their CC cream and their confidence in a cream foundation is some of my faves of all time. I like it. You know, she started on QVC. Yeah, I know. And she, they do amazing girls on QVC. Because so when I'm sad and at home, <laughs> I sit and I watch QVC. And that's how I discovered it. And then I bought it. Get it? I actually love... I Get thought it. I was going to be Somebody in love with jokes. their mascara. Yeah. And the problem is, is it incredible like the first two times yeah and then i don't know what happens to the thing yeah for me like the money is so at the, the face cream stuff i'll have to like, try the face cream the um regular cc cream is just it's incredible i use right, it I'm as my foundation it. and it's one that you can also kind of build too if you want heavier coverage and stuff so that makes me pretty excited um i usually kind of do a squirt on my hand how's the blending so, so far the blending's actually going a lot rougher than it's ever gone with anything before. That's what I'm wondering is so. I'm seeing the color and I'm not. So yeah, this is definitely an experiment. Like Let's I see. Said. I mean, it's blending. Let's yeah. just see what happens. Let's see what happens. We We're may want to like, re-blend or re-grind again. Let's see what. ready to pop this screen and, and Let's see. see. What well, actually, that's quite nice. Can I take a peek? Oh, Yeah. It's quite I, nice. And you, you can mix it again. Yeah, I'm not Do a little unhappy mixing, at all with what I'm not we're unhappy. Seeing. No, it's fine. I mean, I'm seeing a little bit of the white. Yeah. But I don't think that that white goes on white anyway, so I'm not as worried about it being streaky. Yeah, it definitely doesn't go on white. Uh, it, it, it really is. Shout out to Wet n Wild. It really is quite the good, ultra cheap mattifying There's... kind of like face powder in a pinch so i'm gonna drop in my big my big 10 and like so let's said, see if we fill this one if not we're gonna redump and go smaller because we wanted to have a full pan because i don't know about you but i hate it when i go to use a powder and it's down and the center is all warped out I hate that stuff and it doesn't go on hate your it. brush evenly hate it so we want a full pan and you know you can break up your makeup and make it into smaller pans once you get a hole in the center or you use the Did center Did you guys out? just hear that? Yeah. That's kind of so big. I mean, yeah. Because that's really annoying. Let's see where you're at with this guy. I think we're at the fill line. Let's see. I think if we like... Yeah, get all the little bits out. And level. And I think nice we are at level. our fill line potentially. Uh, maybe a little more. I think maybe we need some more. Maybe add a little more. Let's it's do it. Be just adding a little bit more. And then I'm going to go Let's through this, this process is. again. This was already super, super easily well grinded. You are so right. This is not translucent. So. No, it's really not. Um, wow. No hate, though. No, no, no. It's a like, nice, like, pale And for a person like for me, you, it it's a good really one. Well. Yeah. yeah, this would be way too white for me. Yeah. I've got too much yellow. So as you guys can see, this is what's happening. So this is... Kind of what we can start like expecting from a little piece smush. of fur in there. Yeah. <laughs> this is what we can this start expecting from our This is what it's like when I make makeup smush. at my house with my dog. I have a husky. So yeah. I have fur in all my makeup. It's okay. No more is it vegan. No, it's not vegan. It's um, okay we're not eating it. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, <laughs> not today. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe another time. Who knows, folks? Who knows? Um, and again, I want to just shout out to this brush. Uh, this thing has been through quite a bit and it's still hanging tough. So again, um, I'm finding mm -hmm. myself having a hard time getting it through the screen because it was already a loose powder instead of a pressed makeup color. 
So this is something users need to be well aware of. If you're expecting Fixie to do things it's not meant to do, it's not gonna do them. And you can't blame Fixie for that. That's your own dumb ass. Well, I think it will go through, but I haven't, like I said, the loose powder thing is a new game for me. I've tested it and not had the best luck. You know what is such a bummer? And if any of you guys out there can figure it out with your Fixie kit, you need to call me. How the heck to press glitter? <gasps> I want to press glitter so bad. And it's fun. Um, it doesn't press very well. I like the idea. Not alone. I'm like you may, And I've tried mixing it with some others and it's... I'm going to go ahead and I'm I'm tap out while, here. Yeah, you know what, girl, while I'm give that to me this. for one sec, will you? She's too I much can't. Much I'm too anal. Just I'm not going to let that go in there like that. Ridiculous. Sorry, people. She's getting out more tools, which I love. Well, this is the tool that comes yeah. with it. I didn't just go get this one. Well, at the end. Family. See, look at that. Tap, yeah. tap, tap. All in, yeah, she in like, there. There you go. happen. I was like, it's getting stuck. It's probably not going to work. And she's like, make it work. It's so, going through. All right, beautiful. done. Awesome. I'm excited. Okay. Yeah, this looks like... This looks great. I like that. I'm excited. I like that I, I, That's plenty. Um, here, you want a little brushy guy? And I here's why I'm brush. excited about having a pressed powder versus a loose powder. Is because I can keep it in the Fixie palette with my blush and my eyeshadow. And you have a whole face. And I have a whole face. That's I'm ready fun. To go. That's what the cool thing about depotting is. Yeah. Depotting gets simplifies your life. You guys, it's like decanting, only like way more awesome because yeah. you're not gonna have a hangover. And you can depot with Fixie, and you never could before. Like without having a Fixie kit, good luck depotting. You are gonna break those things. The silly pan's gonna break. You're not gonna be able to put it back in. And, and whole you're fun depotting project. It is now a hot mess. And again, your because you're because you're yeah because you broke your eyeshadow in the process of depotting it or whatever you're gonna depot breaks. Right. I like how far. All right, so we're gonna give it like make sure it's all as, as level as you can get. Do you need a, this guy? Somebody I'm like gonna let this. her do it because I'm like, sorry, I'm taking over. So again, smusher, big smush. I'm gonna do it for ten seconds. All right, good. that's probably good. So we're gonna let's lift take a peek and see nice where we're and at. Gently. Exactly. Oh my word. <laughs> Folks, obviously I was not expecting right, this. Right, right. I don't think that Jill was. I was either. not expecting this at all. <gasps> it's gorgeous. It's Get off the really little nice. bits. I wonder if it's you could use it or if it's loose and crumbles. Okay, let's find out. I have no idea. So first of all, I'm just gonna tap tap, tap, off tap the, to see if anything falls out. And nothing is falling out. Nothing is Hello, tap, 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 tap. Watch the whole thing. Whoa. Down. Tap, 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 tap. That's actual <gasps> pressure. It looks Nothing so pretty. Has this looks gorgeous. Okay, <gasps> let's swap. Okay, I'm swatching with my finger. Oh, nice finger. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm swatching with the other finger now. Always swatch with the middle. And I'm just going to go on the cheek. What do we have? What do we have happening? That's nice. Let's go for the nose, Oh, you right? want some brush? See if it works with the brush. Do you use this brush or a different I one? I do. Probably so a fatter you, one. You guys, you might get some pink. So, sorry. I'll try to All right. Well, let's see. This. Oh, I didn't. Okay, so ready? Let's see if it's staying on there. It's a little flaky off. A little flaky. I don't know. That's why I said I'm not sure. <gasps> but again, I would just tap. Anyway, I would just tamp it on. I wouldn't be like. Do you feel like rub. we need to like bind it? I think I want to spray it with the binding. Three I think we should just do a little bit and again. push. All right, I'm gonna spray this time. Yeah, and I'm gonna start it. with two sprays. Okay, give it a go. I'm gonna move this. Okay, two sprays. Uh, I mean, it doesn't even look wet. Let's go one more spray. Go one more, just because. Make sure. Okay. It's even better now. I think it might even be firmer. I think so too. Let's try our brush test. Get the again. brush test and see if it's gonna flake off. Oh, <gasps> no give flaking! It a circle. Oh my gosh. There's no flaking. Okay, cool. So there we go. Now All I right, have, now. wow, that was so fast and easy. And we even experimented with Hilo. So now I have my full face for Alt, for Palm Springs. Oh, cool. Gosh, that's really fun. That is really fun. This is amazing. Again, this is all I need. I can throw this in my purse and have it with me. But anyway, that's what we have All for right. today. That's fun. That was I am so amazed. fun. <laughs>